Hey, this is Charles from Returns Gold. Um, I've been doing a couple wall hangings lately, and I'm going to go ahead and do the, one of those for you today. Um, to do that, I'm going to take this piece of uh, redwood and transpose a sketch of an ocean, uh, roughly based on a picture that a friend posted. Um, it's going to have some mountains in the background and then some uh, a beach scene. And the beach is going to contain three different stones, a sodalite, a turquoise-ish um, decoration stone, and then white marble for the... Uh, for the waves, I'm going to do some uh, mountains and a hunter green slate and then a um, sun. And the sun is going to be in a uh, reddish quartzite stone. So we're going to go ahead and get started on that. Start by uh, putting the picture on here and hopefully end up with a unique piece of art. So we'll go ahead and get started on that. So here's the basis of my picture, um, just a simple sketch that uh, of a beach that I found online and sketched it out real quick. And I'm going to go ahead and inlay the stone on it. Um, the so most solid colors, those are the ones I'm going to do first uh, because those are going to be the ones that the cutting with the uh, sandpaper will eat away the most wood. So we're going to go ahead and start carving those out. have uh, soda light, um, the chips, and this is the powder. Then we have marble, and then the marble powder. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and start the inlay. inlay done I'm gonna go ahead and do the uh, secondary inlay and that'll be this area right here this will be the actual main water 
Um, and this will be done with a uh, blue stone. It's just a simple uh, decor decoration rocks that I uh, picked up at any um, home decoration store. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and inlay that right here so it'll give a three-tone effect. So I'll go ahead and start carving. All right, now that I've got all the stone inlay done and a quick coat of finish on top of it, I'm going to go ahead and build the frame. And for this, I'm going to frame it basically having these pieces of pine. And the top and bottom piece are going to stick out just a little bit. Um, so to do this, I'm going to go ahead and first glue the sides on, clamp them down really well. And then once that's done, I'm going to shave down the edges just a tiny bit and then go ahead and put the top and bottom on. And then I'm going to sand it up. Uh, put a coat of finish on it and uh, be done. So we'll go ahead and get this finished and I'll show you what the uh, finished product looked like.